أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم اقرأ بسم ربك الذي خلق خلق الإنسان من علق اقرأ وربك الأكرم الذي علم بالقلم علم الإنسان ما لم يعلم صدق الله العظيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Respected Chief Guest, CEO of Local Government Authority, Madam Afshan Latif, State Minister of Arts, Culture and Heritage, Mr. Muhammad Tariq, Deputy Minister of Ministry of Arts, Culture and Heritage, Mr. Ahmad Mohsin, Director of Asia Foundation, Mr. Anton Nalatambi, Country Representative, Mr. Johan Rebert, Deputy Vice Chancellor of Maldives National University, Dr. Aishat Shehnaz Adam, Chief Librarian of MNU Library, Dr. Amal Ali. Head of Department, Director of the National Library, Ms. Disham Abdul, Rash Abdul Rashid. And distinguished guests, Assalamu Alaikum and good evening. Welcome to the inauguration of Let's Read, Freedom Program organized by the National Library of Maldives in collaboration with the Asia Foundation and the Maldives National University. The event began with the citation of Holy Gurwan by Ms. Shiona Ibrahim, Assistant Librarian of National Library. I am Amrit Rim, Assistant Librarian from National Library, and I will be your host for today. I would like to request Country Representative Johan Rebert to present the opening remarks. Mr. Johan Rebert. Thank you very much, and good afternoon to everybody. I hope you can. Here, it's so nice to see so many smiling faces. I'm so delighted to see so many beautiful children on this call. And no, I, I'm not going to talk for very long because everybody wants to hear the stories today, the stories that are on the Let's Read platform. So I'll speak very briefly and then uh, hand it back. Uh, mic back. Um, I just want to appreciate and say a very thank you to some partners uh, who have been working very closely with us on this project. I want to thank uh, especially uh, Madam uh, Latif, uh, CEO of the Local Government Authority for being the chief guest today and speaking today. Uh, I'd like to thank also the State Minister and Deputy uh, uh, State Minister who, is, who are on the call, which is great to, to have uh, high level representation uh, thank you also to our colleagues at the MNU, uh, Dr. Adam and Dr. Amal Ali, as well as our very close friends at the National Library uh, of the Maldives and, and um, Ms. Shona for helping to organize this. The Asia Foundation, we've been uh, working in the Maldives for many years and we have many good friends uh, in the Maldives. I'm speaking to you now from, from Sri Lanka. I am in, in Colombo in Sri Lanka, but I really miss having the chance to come and visit all our friends in Mali and in the Maldives right now. And we're really looking forward to that day that we can come and, and be with you again. Um, the Let's Read platform is, is supported by the Asia Foundation, but really with our partners, such as the, the, the MNU and the National Library. It's a platform that is free of charge, so it's available to everybody. It's accessible through a smartphone or a tablet or, or through the website. It looks at engaging children who are between 5 to 15 years of age and to help young students get into the habit of reading. It's so important to, to have a practice, to learn to read, to help get your parents as well to, to read to you. Um, you know, young people who read grow up into adults who read. And adults who read really help us to have a thriving and, and a safe and secure and a healthy society. So that's why it's so important to, to read uh, and read lots of, of different things as well. So very happy with this platform. We have now about 
750 books in English language, and I hope that all the children here get a chance to look at some of these books. I'm happy to say that we have now, with the, the help of our friends at the, the university, uh, 166 books in Divehi, and this number is growing as well. So we want to have more, more books in Divehi language, and we want to have original Divehi language books as well. So original Maldivian writers writing in Divehi who can share their stories on this platform as well. So please uh, follow us, follow the platform on, on Facebook and, and, and stay engaged. There's content on, on Facebook in, in Divehi and we hope to have more of that as we go along. I'm very happy to say that the Maldives has been outstanding in terms of all the countries that we work with in terms of sharing this platform. Just in the last year, we've had uh, uh, just over 50,000 readers on this platform and about 730,000 books that were accessed. So a, a book was read 730,000 times. So this is a huge amount of, 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 of times the platform has been accessed in the Maldives. And I think uh, per capita, so per, per person in the Maldives, it's the first number of people who have accessed this content across all our offices, the Asia Foundation, we have 18 offices across Asia, and the Maldives is, has been number one so far. So we really want the Maldives to keep this position of being number one, and all the kids on the call today, hope that you will access, and I hope your parents will access the content, and you will help us and give us feedback as well in terms of how we can improve and develop it. So that's all I'm going to say. I'm not going to speak very much more, but so happy to have this event. And I hope we have more of these reading events and more children and parents involved as well. So thank you very much to, to all our partners. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Johan Rebert. Next on agenda is perhaps the most exciting part of this event for the children. Assistant Librarian Ms. Ashfa Muhammad from the National Library will read a story in Divi language using the Let's Read platform. Ms. Ashfa Muhammad. Salam alaikum. Mia to Mjolani Tihuriha Kudina Vara Dri Tivaha Kekiade. Mivaha Kaganamaki Ah Hali Bang Dung Drum Drum. Dung dung. Dung coco. Baby doni bunya. Kiki. Coco doni. Hale lava mong esse. Dung coco. Even mundia adufa gandu. Hulang undagu wa mundia. Coco dunya levo no ha bar elamo. Hulamuka bernu kurigo. Machang elia. Mande. Machang eli kuda kuda go. Irukola komati ga hifetilapa. Wet and the don't at the behaya the man one hang bear a shake. No, no, cock a gecko. Cock a donny, Roy got it. Baby McGinnis, Denny. A gun at the jeheto, gun tirium udo sagar namo, baby donny bunya. Kuliaka, cock a donny, had a lavagate. Mamma, papa, at the cock a donny, ink at a congoalia. Bola da samalu be, rakka teri be. Nasib, bola lo ke kibang bebe doni salam evi hama kiri yaay. Namaves, itano ga bearnu kora mandi ameshin ta ko ke adufakkan do ga sababu bebe donya mama mendim bola lo ke inzar garden nui be. Meshin ta ko ke adufakkan do ga da kamu doni tamua salat kora mani hura selega mefe. Aharu mena mita mihar ma nurakka bejje. Bapa doni bunya. A haruman avaha minundi maka badaluang ebajehe. Kuriha doni take foshitam mati bandukuram fashafi. Ekamako etanum gendan and ugendan etse kandala. Coco donia undagovi. Coco doni gengurun come etse decaves coco doni varalo bive. Coco gendani coco lobi va fiat. Ehem bonamon, baby doni, a fiat a bandukurang or on it. Eva good. A was a colabula, misa, but much on a barra. Bapa ehem bonamon, emming avaha, a hali dukon, udu sagate. 
އެގޮތަށް ކުއްލިއަކަށް ދާނެ ޖެހެމުން ކޮއްކޮ ދުވަނި ލޯބިން ގެންގުޅުނު ފިޔަތަ ގެންދެވޭ ގޮތެއް ނުވިއެ ކޮއްކޮ ދުވަނި ދެރަވެގެން ހާއްޔާ ދިމާއަށް އެސުރުގެ ފިޔަގަނޑުން ހަނަ އަޅަމުން ބުންޏެ ލޯބިވާ ފިޔަތަކަށް ހާލި ދޫކޮ ކޮއްކޮ މި ދަނީ އަލްވަދާއު އަޑުގަދަ ރީންދޫ މެޝިނުގެ އަޑުތަ ދޫކޮ ކޮއްކޮ މި ދަނީ ރޫއިމުގެ އަޑަކުން ކޮއްކޮ ބުންޏެ ලිබුණි හෑරං කමක රීති රාගෙගා බේබේ දෝනි ගෝවාලිය පලා පලා කොක්කෝ කෙ ලෝපි ෆියත කොක්කෝ දුන්ය ගබෝලු කරන්නස් උඳ ගෝවිය කොක්කෝ ගෙන්ගුලන ෆියතකුම් බය ෆියත හාලින් උදුහි ගතුමගෙ කුරින් මම්ම දුවනි වනි රක්කා කොෆ්ෆේ බුර දුවහ කොෆ්ෆ හුරි හා දුවනි තකෙ වෙස් වනි වර බොඩ වරු බලි වෙෆේ ලෙස්ටෝරිටෝන් The English demonstration will be present by Joel Prakash from the Asia Foundation, followed by the demonstration, Divine Language by Librarian, Ms. Fatwit Nashfa from the Maldives National University. I would like to request Mr. Joel Prakash to present the demonstration. Mr. Joel Prakash. Uh, yes, thank you. Uh, good evening, everyone. I am uh, Joel Prakash. I will be uh, demonstrating to you all uh, how to use the uh, let's read uh, platform and then how to download the uh, android app which is available for you uh, free of charge uh, let me just share my screen first <clears throat> uh, i hope you can see my screen uh so this is as you can see this is our uh, website the letrit platform so to in order to get into this uh, website you will have to type uh, www.letritasia.org i will i will share the link with you all uh, on the chat chat section so as you can uh, see when you access the uh, platform uh, here these are the books which are available for you free of charge you don't have to uh, pay pay or you don't have to uh, subscribe for any uh, account you, you can simply uh, read it from the platform uh, what you can do is the first uh, section uh, when when you take the first section the languages uh, at the moment we are having more than uh, 40 40 languages on the platform these are all translated books which are available uh, which was available in english 750 books so as you can see you can <clears throat> scroll down through this uh and then you can choose the language which you which you want so we'll just check the english books no so so these are all the plat- uh, all the books which are available on the platform uh, in english language so when you scroll down if you want to go see more books you just have to click load more so you will be uh, taken into all the all the books which are available in english uh, as you know the books are on the platform uh, aimed at uh, 5 to 15 ages so this is the my first book is the lowest range and uh, level 5 will be the uh, highest range which is for uh, 14 and 15 year, year olds and also we have made uh, tags we have uh, created tags for each uh, books which are available on the platform so that it's easy for you all to read uh, according to the category you choose uh so you have to uh, what you have to do is uh, <clears throat> from here if you want to uh, read some books uh, regarding to animals just have to click the uh, animal tag and then the platform will take you to all the books which are available uh, regarding animals 
also if you know the uh, know the book in advance if you have a, if i have idea of the title of the book or if someone else has recommended you to read a, read a book from the platform what you can do is you can simply uh, type the uh, title here on the search bar and then uh, the, you will be taken into that uh, particular book which you want to read also when if you can see here it says uh, get it on uh, google play this at the moment the uh, application is available only in uh, uh, android uh, android uh, phones and tabs and we are working on uh, publishing a, a ios version as well in the near future so at the moment you can download it uh, from the uh, android app uh, that's also the <clears throat> app is free for you so from your tabs and uh, phones uh, android tabs and phones you can simply download uh, the app and then also you can download the books uh, and uh, read it offline uh, also, you can share this with your friends and uh, colleagues and, uh, and your uh, teachers in school so that uh, others will uh, make benefit of this uh, platform. So you can share it using uh, Facebook and then you, uh, you can use, uh, you can share, you can tweet it out or else you can attach it to an email and also you can share it. Uh, saying that, I'll just show you one book, how to access the book and how to download the books. Uh, We'll just choose this book. So, <clears throat> in order to go to the book, you just have to click the uh, title, and uh, this is the book which is uh, which we are going to try to uh, check it out. So here you can see these are the uh, only these two languages are available. So each book will be translated into different languages uh, and Vivek uh, as well. So. If you want to choose the language from, if you want to change the language, you can do it from here as well. You can choose choose the language from here, and then you can read that particular book. Uh, to read, just have to click this uh, read button, and then you will be taken into the <coughs> web uh, web book here, and then you can uh, start reading from here. So, if you if you want to make the text a bit a uh, bit uh, bigger, you just have to click. Uh, click this uh, text button here and then you can make the uh, text a bit uh, bigger and then you can uh, scroll across the book using these arrows. You can also download this book in uh, EPUB. Uh, most of the books are available in uh, uh, PDF version and uh, so this book is only available in uh, EPUB version so you just have to download, uh, click this and then you can download the EPUB version and uh, read the book offline. Uh, so saying that, I think that's pretty much it. I will share the link on the uh, chat box so that you can access the platform. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, Mr. Joel Prakash. Now I would like to call upon Ms. Patmat Nashpa to present a demonstration in the way language. Ms. Patmat Nashpa. Tisha, any kind of world they have different. I don't even know. Is it possible to get this site for information? Yes, it is possible. The yeah. if you Dada, open, they have to go with their parents. They don't have to go with strangers. That If 
you look at the chat box, there is a link now. Just press the link. Just press the link and open. And you can choose your own book and you can read it. Okay? Just press the link in the chat box. Okay. Okay. ক্লিক <laughs> <laughs> ডিসক্রিপশন <laughs> আলে বেবে Exactly how many stories are there? There are over 700 stories. About 120 of them are in Divehi. Isn't that wonderful? Yes. Yes, yes ma'am. Yes. yes. Thank you, Ms. Parkman Nashpa. Now it is time for another interesting story. I would like to request Chief Librarian of Maldives National University, Dr. Amal Ali, to present the story in English language. Dr. Amal Ali. Hello, friends. Hello, friends. How are you? Are you happy? Everybody? Yes. 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 All right. You're yes. Yes. Okay. Now, um, uh, would you be willing to listen to me read? And when I ask you a question, just uh, put the mic off, but reply. Put the mic off, but reply. So that all the boys and girls who are listening will be able to hear my voice clearly. My name is Amal Datta. Amal Datta. What is your name? My name is Mariam Zaya. 
Thank you, Zaya. My name is Amar. My name is Imshan. My name is Ruth. My name is Yuna. My name is Ruth. 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 Thank you. Now, boys and girls. My name is Ruth. My name is Aisha Taika. Thank you, boys and girls. I heard it. My name is Amar. All right. Now, do you know that when you are listening to a story, you need to be quiet? Do you think you might be able to put two hands over your ears, please? Right. Thank you so much. And when I ask you a question also, just say it out loud, but don't keep the mic on. We want you to participate. Yes. But you also want me to be heard so that all the children can hear me read. Okay. I'm Amal Datta. I'm going to read to you a story written by Anwar Ibrahim. Anwar Ibrahim is one of our brothers. He is a Maldivian writer. He writes both in English and in Dilehi. And this time I'm going to read a book that he has written to you in Dilehi, in English. This story I believe is also in English and in Divehi, and you can find it on this platform. This is a wonderful platform if you're interested in reading. And I can hear all of you wanting to read more. So let me begin the story. The story is called Misha. Maybe some of you have that name. Do you have Misha as your name? Anyone? No. 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 Okay, Haira Dundi, can you just stop talking now? Shh. And let Amal Dutta read a story for you. Here are the pages. I want you, I want you all to be listening to the story of Misha and read along with me, but not making any loud noises so that anybody else could hear. I wonder what this story is about. Ooh, we can see a grandpa. We can see the sea. And we can see Misha coming running to grandpa. Misha is the youngest girl in her family. Misha meets every single person in the household daily. Today is no different. She is on her way to meet her. Hmm, I wonder who. Meet her grandfather. Grandfather was covering his mouth because he was coughing. Misha also wanted to cover her mouth. Precious daughter, you too should cover your mouth when you cough, said her grandfather. I am sure, boys and girls, your grandfather would have told you the same. You put your hands over your mouth when you cough. Now, who is she talking to now? Ooh, Misha, grandmother. Misha is now visiting her grandmother. Grandmother was washing her hands with soap. She also wanted to wash her hands. Precious daughter, you too should wash your hands frequently with soap. Just the way I'm doing, said her grandmother. I'm sure your grandmother also would have said something like that 
to you, right? Boys and girls? Yes, I am sure. So we move on. I wonder what Misha is going to do now. Let's see, let's see. Wow, she's got a broom. And who is she with? Hmm, wow. Oh, it's her father. Misha went to see her father and the father was mopping the floor with Dettol to keep the house clean. Misha also wanted to clean the house. So what did the father say? Precious daughter. What is the meaning of the word precious daughter? That Vladimir Burani Ranganda, he got a Burani Ranganda, Dondoni, hard how far with J. Mamma, not a bapa, not a mamma, not a papa, him Burakala, wording a precious daughter. You too should clean the floor of your play area with my help, said a father. Then go talk about Michatani. Ooh, now let's see. A pretty lady is with Misha. Who could that be? Misha went to her mom, her mother. Mother was getting ready to go out and was wearing a mask. Look, Misha's mom was wearing a mask. She also has a bag with her. So it does look like Misha's mom is going out. Hmm, maybe to buy you a chocolate. Maybe to get me a chocolate? What do you think? I'm wearing this mask because there's a virus spreading in our country. Precious daughter, Lobirangada, you two should wear a mask if you have to go out, said her mother. I don't see, I don't see the screen. Oh, you don't see the screen? Anybody else? Can you see the no, screen? No. Yes, I can see the screen. 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 I can see the Ah, oh, went to see her eldest brother. What is the word eldest, I wonder? Hmm, let's see. Brother was wiping his phone with a cloth. Okay. Misha also wanted to wipe the phone. Dearest little sister, you too should wipe and clean your toys, said her eldest brother. Hmm, and then... Misha sees another lady. Misha went to see her eldest sister. Misha was touching her face by the time she saw her eldest sister. Dearest little sister, to prevent any germs from your hands entering into your body, hmm, you should avoid touching your face, your eyes, your mouth, and your nose, said her elder sister. Hmm. 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 I wonder who this is. Next, Misha went to see her second elder brother. He had cleared his throat <coughs> and was entering the bathroom <coughs> to spit it up. Misha also wanted to enter the bathroom to spit. Dearest little sister, you should use the bathroom. If you need to spit, but do not spit outside the house or on the road, said her brother. And do not spit at the same time, I would like to add, with the brother. So both your spits will go into the bathroom. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Anyway, moving on the story. Yes, my dearest, just hold on. Just a little few minutes and I'll let you talk. Here's Misha. I wonder who Misha is with. Misha went to her second elder sister. She had completed her prayer just then and was supplicating to Akuran. Misha also wanted to pray. Dearest little sister, 
you too should pray and supplicate for your good health. Allah is merciful, said her sister. Thank you, boys and girls, for being so quiet and listening to me. Let me go on for a little while longer and then reach out. Everyone is doing something, Dr. Bisha. I will also do the same. And then she started counting what everyone was doing. Hmm. Hmm. What everyone was doing. She started counting what everyone was doing. Okay, now, boys and girls, your turn to tell me. Now you can put the mics on if you like and reply. Your second, uh, uh, our sister was praying. Thank you. Thank you so much. I will give you a big clap for all the good answers. For all the boys and girls who gave the right answers. Now there are some more questions, some more questions, some more questions on this page and it goes to the last page. I too will do all of them to stay safe from diseases, said Misha. Okay, when you have completed reading the book, try to answer the question. Now, these questions I want you to read in your own time because now you know how to ask. Now you can ask me if you don't know. What is the name of the book? You can talk now. Okay. Where do you find it? Where do you find it? Where do you find it? Yes. In your mom's let's phone. Let's read our phone and find Okay, on the let's read. That's all. And you can get that. She has a youngest sister. That's right. And you can read that from the platform by downloading the story. Okay? So, I want you to read the question so that you go away and have something to answer when you are looking for the answer. So can you read with me? Who is Misha in the family? The youngest how many members are in the family, including Misha? Eight How many members? Eight members. How many females are there in the family? Who was mopping the floor? Was it mother or the father? It was father. Father. Read number six. I hope you enjoyed this story. And if you want to listen to more stories like this, you can tune in to 
you can tune in to Let's Read and Read by Yourself. Or I have another proposition, which is, what is I'm, I'm going to read on a program <laughs> called Clubhouse. And it's called Read and Inspire. Clubhouse, Read and Inspire. Every day of the week from 4.30 to 5.30. There will be a flyer coming out soon and we shall meet again. Thank you very much, boys and girls, for listening. This is Amal Datta saying, until next time, and let the program go on. Bye. Bye. Excuse me, Amal Datta. Bye. 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 Okay, one last question. What was it that you were saying? Yes, one last question. Yes, yes. I don't have to look. I read all these books. You want to read all of these books. Wow! I am so excited. Make sure you do and let me know. I hope you find out. Yes. Oh, this. Yes. I wish uh, I have. Okay. So, yeah, I also read. wish I hope there is more. These are okay. all books on Let's Read. Yes. And you know exactly where to find them, and you know exactly what's it about, and you know that there are over 700 books that you can read from, and you know that there are some many books also you can read from. Teacher, I have a question. I know, dear, but let us give this opportunity to the next speaker until we meet again. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Dr. Amalali, for the interesting story. The story reminds us to stay safe. I would like to request Chief Guest, CEO of Local Government Authority, Madam Afshan Latif, to deliver the speech. Madam Afshan Latif. Bismillah Rahman Rahim, um, State Minister for Arts, Culture, and Heritage, Mr. Mohammad Thorig, Deputy Minister, Mr. Ahmad Mohsin, Deputy Vice Chancellor of MNU, Dr. Aisha Shehnaz Adam. Uh, Chief Librarian of the National Library of the Maldives, Dr. Amal Ali. Director of Asia Foundation's Book Program, Mr. Anton Nalatambi. Country Representative of Asia Foundation, Mr. Rohan Yerrebat. Esteemed guests and everyone, especially all you lovely children joining this wonderful event today. Good afternoon. Firstly, I would like to thank Dr. Amal Ali for the kind invitation to participate in this collaborative event of MNU National Library of the Maldives and Asia Foundation. It is my absolute honor and pleasure and I'm truly impressed with the Let's Read program. Thank you for the lovely stories we heard today as well. I would also add that this has been the most fun event I have ever attended. As a child, I was very shy and quiet. I was very fortunate that my parents, especially my beloved mother, were very supportive of my immense interest in books. Books helped me to grow, to dream, to think of the world and the people in it, to actually fall in love with the world and the people in it. Books gave me this quiet, shy girl I was, the wings to fly. When I talk about reading, it is always with fondness that I recall how my mom would introduce me to various classics, Oliver Twist, Great Expectations, Black Beauty, A Tale of Two Cities, Robinson Crusoe, Treasure Island, and many, many more. I grew up with the famous five and the secret seven as friends. Later following the adventures of Nancy Drew, the Hardy Boys, and Agatha Christie. I spent a lot of time with my nose in a book and still do and can truly say they have played a huge role in shaping who I am today. So I'm especially excited about the Let's Read program of Asia Foundation, which aims to make books accessible to children between the ages of five and 15. As we will all agree, living through this global pandemic of COVID-19 has been hard and especially hard for children. I'm sure all of you kids will agree. 
having to stay indoors without going to school or playgrounds, not meeting friends or getting to develop their social skills will obviously take a toll. As the mother of two young kids, I understand this very well. The fact that Asia Foundation initiated the Let's Read program for kids during this time is really admirable. And I too hope as the foundation does, does that this engagement will lead to a lifelong habit and love of reading. One of my favorite authors, Maya Angelou said, um, any book that helps a child to form a habit of reading, to make reading one of his deep and continuing need is good for him. I do hope that this program will serve this purpose for many, many kids in the Maldives too. I commend Asia Foundation for the tremendous work they have done with the program. I'm grateful that the ministry, MNU and the National Library have taken such a keen interest and partnered in these efforts so well. As we heard before, the program has over 700 books in English and 166 books in Divahi, which is fantastic. It's amazing to know there were 50,000 readers here. I was also delighted to know there is a Facebook page for the program in the Maldives, which is updated weekly with new content and articles on how to improve reading habits. So it's not just great for kids, but adults as well. I hope this program will bring together families in sharing the joys of reading. Um, the famous philosopher Cicero said, a room without books is like a body without a soul. Lucky for us, we don't need a lot of space or money for books now. With smartphones and such programs as Let's Read, we have them on digital platforms to access at our own convenience. We have access to entire worlds at our fingertips. It is my hope that information about Let's Read program will be spread continuously and constantly so that children across the country can access these books. In my area of work, I'm very determined to share information about the program with local councils and encourage to share amongst their communities and get as many children engaged in the program as possible. Once again, a huge thank you to Asia Foundation for this brilliant initiative and the Ministry of Arts, Culture and Heritage, Maldives National University and National Library of the Maldives for their excellent efforts. Thank you for having me here today. Thank you for all the kids who are joining today and made this such a pleasurable experience. I wish you all the success with the Let's Read program and hope to be of any help in any way I can. Thank you. Thank you, Mir. Thank you, Madam Afshan Latif. Last but not least, I would like to request Director of the National Library, Ms. Amnat Shuna, to deliver the closing remarks. Ms. Amnat Shuna. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim, CEO of the Local Government Authority. Madam Afshan Latif, State Minister of the Ministry of Arts, Culture and Heritage, Mr. Muhammad Tariq, Deputy Ministers, distinguished guests, colleagues, participants, and all children. Assalamu alaikum. Um, it is a privilege and a great joy for me to extend a word of thanks to all those who have contributed in one way or the other to make this event a success. The Asia Foundation is a non-profit or international development organization committed to improve lives across a dynamic and developing Asia. Past years, the Asia Foundation was helping, helping us to build a reading community by donating books. I thank the Asia Foundation for their assistance and acknowledgement and and acknowledge the support rendered by the director, Mr. Anton Alatambi and his team. A very special round of thanks is due to the Maldives National University. The generosity in, the, in offering their expertise and collaboration. Unfortunately, um, sorry, undoubtedly uh, MNU team uh, played a key role in making this event successful. It is, um, it is very humbling that Dr. Amal took such a keen interest in ensuring the smooth running of our program. I would like uh, to thank Deputy Minister, Minister Mr. Ahmed Mohsin for his guidance and encouragement throughout this process. A heartfelt thank you to our team 
of very motivated and dedicated colleagues of Maldives National Library who know their job and result oriented. I cannot thank everyone enough for their involvement and their willingness to, to take on the, on the completion of this task. You deserve congratulations for a good job done. Before concluding, once again, let me express our sincere gratitude and appreciation uh, to the guest of honor, CEO of the local government authority, Madam, Madam Afshan, uh, for her interest and support with such program and, and State Minister of Ministry of Arts, Culture and Heritage, Mr. Tariq, uh, and everyone else who have raised this event with their presence here today. Thank you all children for participating. Thank you everyone.